I'm Delphine Bissessa and I choose to challenge the norm. I'm Sunita Balabika, I choose to challenge challenges. I'm a mother, I'm a wife, I'm a daughter, but I'm also an engineer and a leader and a disruptor. From a young age, my parents have always told me that I could aspire to be whoever I wanted to be, that I could achieve whatever I set out to do. Most importantly, they told me that I didn't need to conform to society standards, that I could be different, that I could be me. I have transformed my parents' continued support into believing that nothing is impossible, that there's a solution to every problem um, and that everything can be challenged, even the norm. What if we didn't have to do things this way or think that way or continue doing things like we've always done? What if there's a better way of doing things or, or think? As a woman in tech, I've always involved in a male-dominated industry. But what I like about technology is that it doesn't care about your gender or your religion or your ethnic background. It's all the same. Uh, you use your brain to achieve things, to make a difference. And that's what I'm here at Afrasia to do, make a difference. Motherhood has uncovered strengths that I didn't know I have and fears that I never knew existed. In 2012, one of my twin sons was diagnosed with a chronic illness. At that point in time, as much as I was very confident to deal with an ailing child, what I couldn't come to terms with was how to explain to his twin brother, who was perfectly healthy, that his best friend since birth couldn't play with him as they used to be. As much as I wanted to give my all to each one of them, there was a turmoil inside of me. I was fighting for the other one to get better, and at the same time I had to be the normal mother to the healthy twin. The years passed by and we somehow managed to get through it all. Fast forward 2017, where I joined ABL. So joining Afrasia was already a great move in itself. In that same year, I had the opportunity to work on a, on a project, digitalization of the HR systems. And at that same time, my twin fell ill again and it was so serious that again it required overseas treatment. In my mind it was like, okay now what? But then you'll make it just like the other times, just like the other challenges. And I'm proud to say today that not only my son's treatment was successful, at the same time HCM became an internationally acclaimed, well-rounded project that got us awards from reputable bodies. People say that it's hard to be a woman, a wife, a professional, a mother, more so to an ailing child. This is what I found to be the hardest. But looking back now, I would say that I choose to challenge life's challenges and still come out a winner.